you are doing today, my name is Martin, but you can call me Doom Tasty. And what I have for you guys today is a class of the video, as promised. Many of you have asked, well, what is the class of in this video? What is the class of? So today I have three new classes compared to the previous one. I have one with KN, I have one with Cuda, and then I have one with VMP. So two of them, you will see a lot of gameplays with Cuda and with KN44 with this class. So let's just get into it. The first class we have here today is with the Cuda, and as you can see. Uh, let's just start up with the attachments. I'm using Crypt and it's sim just simple to reduce the recoil. Then I'm using Science and I was really surprised because one of my friends he told me to use this class setup because it was actually good and it actually really works so good for me if uh, when you're using a Science on Cuda or Suppressor. So I started to use Suppressor and I did so good because the enemy can't see you on the minimap every time you're shooting, which is a really good thing. So a Suppressor really helps a lot on Cuda. I haven't really tried in other weapons, but example, Cuda is still really good. <clears throat> Cuda is still really good with Silencer, so Silencer is definitely worth it on this gun. Then I'm using Extended Mag to have more uh, bullets in my magazine. Also helps a lot in some gunfights, and if there are like three coming against you, then it's a really good idea to have uh, Extended Mag. Then we have Rapid Fire, Increase the Fire, it's just you're shooting faster, which also will help you in some gunfights because you shoot like a little bit faster than the enemy and then you have a higher chance to kill him <laughs> then we have the perks down here we have afterburn i personally whoops i personally use afterburner because i have a scuff and i jump a lot so afterburner is really a good thing for me because i'm running on the walls a lot i i'm jumping a lot and then it's just easier for me to have afterburner i can't really play without afterburner because then i can't jump so much as i used to then we have scavenger of course because if you want to go for a three, if you want to get high kill gameplays and shit, you need scavenger because then you can't just pick up a weapon from the crown because you're not sure if it's a good weapon if it's uh, like a class similar to this. It could be a can, a good can, but it could also be a sniper with a silence or firm scope and everything. So scavenger is a really good thing so you can keep your uh, weapon from the start and you can pick up ammo from the ground. Then we have uh, on this one blast suppressor because then the enemy can see on the minimap. Many people say that it's it's not really helping that lot. It's not needed, but I really think blast suppressor is really important in, in this game because I'm personally jumping a lot, as I just say, and people can see me every time I jump. And I think blast suppressor is really helping me, especially when I have science on, so they can see me on the minimap when I'm jumping or I'm shooting. So moving on to the next class, we have my can. It's the same perks and it's the same reason. And let's just get the attack for this one. So I'm using first of all quick throw because it really helps me when you aim faster. And on this gun, it really works. I don't use stock on can because stock is not really helping me. It's I don't even know, but have you tried a, a, an assault rifle without stock? I always use stock on my assault rifle, but not in this game. It really works so good without stock. And I've got so many gameplay, so many nucleus with it, class it up. And then I'm using Crypt to recruit, uh, reduce the recoil, especially on long range, can be a lot of recoil, so Crypt really helps a lot. Then I have Fast Max, I'm not using Extended Max in this one, but I don't even know why, but someone told me uh, this class, and it really just works so good. Quick Roll, Crypt, Fast Max, and Rapid Fire, it's a really good class, especially Fast Max, and really faster. Uh, it really helps you a lot in a lot of gunfights and you can reload faster. Then you just have rapid fire again so you can shoot faster and it will be easier to win a gunfight. Moving on to the last class, a little bit different. This is a VMP class and here we have the same perks again. I'm always using the same perks in every class. But on the attachments we have quick draw on this one. If you aim faster with a submachine gun, it's a really good thing, uh, especially with VMP. This could be a, a competitive class. It's a mix of competitive and mob storming, so this will really help you win your gunfight, uh, and especially with the VMP, it's a really good weapon. Then we have Crypt to reduce the recoil, and our VMP got buffed I think in the last update, or one of the last updates, I haven't really used it that much since the start I think. But this gun is actually really good, it's, uh, it's much better than it used to, and people use it a lot now, really like this gun, maybe it's the new best stop machine, I don't know. But on this class, I'm bought using extended max and fast max. And on this class, you will 
you can easily get so many kills because you're using quick roll to aim faster, you're using extended match to have more bullets and then you reload faster too. So you will be able to win a lot of gunfights, you'll be able to like be in a lot of gunfights and you can you have so many bullets and you have the ability to, to reload faster. So this class is really good if you want a lot of kills, if you want a nuclear. So if you wanna try go for a nuclear, always play with a friend who can get a hater. So you can support each other with haters. That's my best tip. So one of these three classes, they're really good to use for pop stomping. And that's pretty much the classes I'm using right now. And it really works so good for me. I got a lot of nuclear the past week or last week. So you should definitely go give it a try. So if you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to leave a like and comment down below what you think about these classes. So guys, thank you for watching. I will speak to you all in my next video.